Hi, everybody. Brad Nessler here, and with me, as always, Kirk Herbstreit and Lee Corso. And even though the sun has gone down, it's going to be a hot one for tonight's game between the Texas Longhorns and the USC Trojans. And we're set to bring you another great matchup in the world of NCAA football. And here come the Trojans. If you compare these teams on paper, they really look to be pretty equal. Kirk, what do you think? USC needs to get the ball in the hands of their athletes. That means getting their running back maybe 25 or 30 touches today. If they do that, Lee, they'll take care of business. I know everyone has been waiting. It's time for my pick. I'm taking USC in this one. This one. Hello, what's up, and what's up? Welcome back for yet another Miles Zucker 24 7 production. And today, we got a little bit of NCAA 06 once again, and we got USC taking on Texas, a little redo of that classic national championship game down in Pasadena at the Rose Bowl. Now, this one is in Jacksonville, Florida, and this is going to be the ACC championship game just so we can get a, a neutral field and stuff like that and get both teams' names and logos in the end zone. That's why I did it. You couldn't picked the Rose Bowl as a game, which sucked back then, but hey, there's no reason to complain about a game that's like 10 years old. So anyways, man, let's get into the gameplay. USC drives down the field, but they don't get nothing going. So Vince Young, uh, aka Matthews, he's going to go down the field, pick up a big first down. Now he's going to roll out and then throw a pick. That's not what we want to see. Come on, man. And like I said, I was going for Texas in this ball game because everybody that I knew was going for USC. I'm from California, so everybody's going for USC. I was going for Texas as we can get an interception with the linebacker Jackson. Gets down the sideline, and we got this one going back the other way. So everybody was like, how you going to stop Reggie Bush? How you going to stop Lindell White? And throughout the whole game, Texas really didn't stop them. You know, they were, they were gashing the Texas Longhorns front seven all day long. But on that fourth and one, they took Reggie Bush off. They took Reggie Bush off of the field. They left Big Lindell White, and Texas knew it was coming. I knew it was coming. You knew what was coming, and it was a power play to Lindell White. And Texas stuffed it, give the ball right back to Vince Young, and the rest was history. So right here, little double pass, little halfback pass back to the quarterback. He's gonna pick up the big first and ten. But now it's third and eleven. Drop back the pass to Burton, and he's gonna get dropped. So Texas gets another big time. I'm second in the early going. It is a defensive struggle. Zero, zero. It's a score. You see my man with the moose. He's doing his little dance out there. I see you, bro. But anyways, man, as we start the second quarter, Texas has the ball. They can get the ball to Bone Anelli or whatever his name is. And Boney, he's going to pick up the big first down. Then look at Matthews. He's going to take off and run. He's going to pitch the ball late, but it don't matter because Texas is moving this ball up and down the field, man. And then we're going to do a direct snap to the halfback. He's going to get up the field. Look at him breaking tackles and getting this one into the USC red zone and then Matthews throwing a strike uh I said he threw a strike listen to that one more time uh right there touchdown Texas and we got a seven point lead so Bernie he's gonna drop back the pass on third down and get sacked and USC goes three and out so up that guy that goes nowhere and Texas goes three and out so USC they got the ball right back and look at that pass going to Mick Gruger and Mick Gruger, aka Dwayne Jarrett, he's gonna make a big time catch. Then they try to get cute, and that's gonna be a backward pass. Lost of five on the play. Burton, he's gonna throw another INT. This time it's to London, and London gonna take that thing to the crib. Touchdown, Texas, and now we got a two possession lead. But this one is far from over. 23 seconds ago in the first half. They can get the ball to Gaines. Whoop! Makes everybody miss. And he is off to the races. And you know that man can run a 4-3 in his sleep. And he's going to take that thing to the crib. Touchdown, USC. Big time run. Timely run at that. As that one is going to end the first half. And only make it a one-score game. So 14-7. Texas on top. But they get the ball first to start, to start the second half. And it's going to be bad. Back to the running game. Back to the running back. Just a little bit of ground and pound, baby. And we're going to pick up a big first down. Then Matthews, he's going to do it himself. Breaks a tackle. Look at how they zoom in so beautifully. Oh, it's pretty. It's so pretty. Matthews dropping back the pass. Has a man. But that pass will be knocked down. And USC gets the ball right back. The Trojans. 
Trojans offense still playing like hot garbage. They throw another INT. That one goes to the crib, and they've only given up one touchdown on defense. All the touchdowns have been coming on the offensive side of the ball. Whenever they keep on throwing picks, Texas keeps on taking them to the crib, and Gaines is out for the rest of the game with a boo-boo on his elbow. So here we go. Burton, he's going to drop back the pass, going up top to McGruger, and he's going to pick up the first down. Burton has time, looking, throwing, taking a shot deep, and oh my goodness, Eweezy as Ely gets into the end zone. Touchdown Trojans. And now it's back to a seven point game. So right now, USC is not going away easily. They get that ball downfield for the touchdown quickly. And now we are back on offense trying to do our thing. Right there, they blow up that, that run play. But on third down, look at Matthews doing it, doing it, doing it. He was in his legs to pick up the first down. Then on second and 10, he going to show you that he can let the thing fly. First down, Texas, huge time pass play down the sideline, and that's going to pick up another fresh first and 10. Move those chains for Texas, and right there, look at that pass bounce off of the USC Trojan into the hands of Texas Longhorn, and then Matthews, he's going to do it himself, picks up the first down on the ground. So USC's down by seven, Texas is on the march. Here goes Matthews, going to roll out, throw this thing up, but it gets batted away. But there's a flag down. Now, this was third and one, and it's holding on Texas, and USC would accept it. So that's good news for Texas, right? So they drop back the pass, and like I said, that's good news for Texas, right? Wrong is that's going to be intercepted by Quinn, and not only did Texas have a chance to go up by 10, now... This one is still a one possession game. And then right there, look at him find E. Weezy as he finds E. Lee down the sideline yet again for a big time first and 10. Then Brooks up that gut. Huge run on the play inside Texas territory. So now second and seven. Back to Brooks up that gut. And now they're in the red zone in Texas. You got to get a stop, man. Burton drops back the pass and he's going to find his man, Mick Ruger. And he's going to get into the end zone touch down you s c so come on matthews come on man we all know you should have been the heisman trophy winner so let's get this thing going third and one can do a direct snap to the halfback and he's going to pick up a fresh first and 10 matthews is feeling this so watch what he does drops back the pass looking for a man and just a little bit too out in front so now matthews what you got for me baby gonna roll out to the left side can we throw this one on the run no we but we break a tackle but then we put it on the turf oh no USC was turning the ball over all first half, and now Texas delivers the favor. It gives a favor right back to the USC Trojans. There goes Burton, dropping back the pass, chucks that one downfield. Touchdown, USC. And they're going to take a seven point lead. Dropping back the pass is Matthews, looking across the middle, and that one's going to be dropped by Griffin. You got to make these catches, man. You got to hang on to them balls. Come on, bruh. This is a big game if you don't know. Matthews drops back the pass again. This time we go to the halfback, and he's going to get up past the 20 yard line, but it's fourth and two, going right back to the running back. And oh my goodness. He really just dropped that. And that's how that one's going to end. 28 to 21, and this one, USC comes back and gets the victory. And this is why we played it in the ACC Championship game, just so we can get the little bit of a presentation at the end. But that's going to wrap this one up. Hope you guys enjoyed the video. As always, I enjoyed bringing it to you. I'm your man, Miles Dawkins 24 7. And I hope that the rest of your day is the best of your day. And I'm going to see y'all later. Peace. Hot sauce.